Hi guys, Abs here. On the 21st of April 2015, Google will be introducing a new ranking factor into the search engine algorithm, whereby if your website is not mobile friendly, then you're not going to be included in the mobile index, you're going to be seeing a reduction in traffic and it's going to feel as if you've been penalized because your website's not mobile friendly and Google is not going to be serving your website to media devices. So anyway, I'm going to be showing you exactly how you can take your WordPress sites, use a free WordPress plugin to make it um, to make it mobile friendly and you can do this with just a couple of clicks so as you can see here I've actually got a website SEO marketing suite it says not mobile friendly if I click on analyze um, then it's going to analyze the site I'll just do this in real time so that you can actually see um, that it's not mobile friendly and then I'm going to show you exactly how we can make this mobile friendly within a couple of within a couple of minutes by using just a few clicks Okay, let this test finish um, so that we can move on. Okay, fantastic. Okay, so I'm going to go over to my website, seomarketingsuite.com, as you can see I'm here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to install a plugin called WP Touch. Okay, so it's WP Touch without any spaces. And I'm going to click on Search Plugins. Okay, and then I'm going to WP Touch Mobile Plugin. I'm going to click on Install now, and I'm going to click on OK. Again, guys, this is totally free of charge, and it requires a couple of clicks, and you're going to be totally mobile compliant. I'm going to click on Activate. Okay, and now what you can see down here is I've actually got a WP Touch settings area here. The core settings, you've got theme extensions, theme menus, and everything. But if you're just looking to make sure that your website can be mobile compliant, then all you have to do is install the plugin and activate it. Now, I'm going to go back over to here. As you can see, I've done nothing with the plugin so far. I'm going to go back over to here. I'm, I'm going to click on Analyze SEO Marketing Suite.com on the same mobile friendly page that Google provides. And what you're going to see. Oops, okay, there was actually a problem loading the website then. I'm going to click on Analyze again. Sometimes Google does time out or it does have issues. Um, so let's just wait until it finishes and we'll see if it's actually made a difference. There we go. Look at that, guys. Awesome. This page is mobile friendly. So by using one plugin real quick, only a couple of seconds work, um, I was able to take my mobile site, which is not friendly, that was going to get penalized on the 21st of April and managed to use a free plugin and make it mobile compliant. Now, the great thing about this, guys, um, is if you actually visit your visit it from your mobile devices, you'll actually see you can also opt to visit the desktop version as well. It's very professional, very cool. It's going to make sure that you're not going to get penalized when the 21st of April hits and um, I highly recommend using it on all your websites unless you've already got a dime unless you've already um, got a responsive theme now when it comes to WordPress guys what we need to understand is um, you've well when it comes to mobile devices you've actually got three ways of making them um, of making or to serve mobile devices one of them is to have a responsive web design now the majority of themes that you're going to get with WordPress now are more than likely going to have a responsive web design um, and that's fantastic but as you can see on here I was actually using a very old plugin uh, or very old theme and because I was using that old theme guys um, it wasn't mobile responsive and I had to use this WP plugin to actually make it mobile responsive um, another way of doing it is dynamic serving which is you're using the same URL but you're you, um, you're not you're using different HTML to show um, and then you've got separate URLs as well whereby you're telling Google if it's a mobile device or you're telling your browser if it's a mobile device and send them over to this page um, and what not you but anyway guys if you're using WordPress the other day I sent out an email and I made my guys know that if you're using WordPress you don't need to worry about it really because you should be fully covered but what I didn't understand or what I didn't um, forget to remember or what I forgot to remember was that obviously all of the older WordPress themes that are not responsive um, are going to require some tweaking so obviously this WP touch plugin is super cool to work with super simple to work with as well and all you need to do is activate it and that's all um, and you're fully mobile ready so anyway guys thank you very much and i hope you enjoy this video